Good afternoon, everybody. Sam Romeo here again this week, environmental educator at Allwood. And have you ever come home from a hike and found seeds stuck to your socks and your clothes? Well, I'm going to talk about some of those weedy, seedy fall seeds that might stick to you that you might find and help you identify some of them. So we'll check out some of the common ones that we find along the trails here at Allwood. Found a nice plethora of this plant. Um, even though there are no seeds to it right now, the flowers actually resemble the seed. And this is tick seed trefoil. And the seeds of this one are actually flat, triangular shaped seeds. And these ones are a pain because they lay flat against their clothes. So you can't get a comb or something and kind of just scrape through your socks, your clothes, and get them all off. You have to individually pick one of, you, one of these off. So the seeds are kind of flat and triangular, just kind of like your flower. And if you notice, all these plants are kind of growing along the trail. So they like that edge habitat. And of course, when you walk by or a deer walks by or something, those seeds are caught in your fur or clothes and brought and dropped somewhere else. So here is a plant that I have pulled off my socks many a times. This is called agrimony. And it's actually in bloom right now. And this is the leaves right here. Kind of have these very unique. But um, the interesting thing about these is these hitch on to humans, animals, um, you know, mostly deer. And they all stick together like that and they very easily can spread all over. And these ones stick very well. Um, they're just kind of little tiny, yeah, little balls there with the hooks just on the end. Here's another hitchhiker plant with a unique leaf. So the leaf, the stem actually goes right through the middle of the leaf. And this is called wood aven. That's A-V-E-N, has a little tiny yellow flower. And they're little hitchhikers are two tiny little pokey balls. And these will actually fall apart when you try to pull them off your clothes. So when you try to pick them off, they might break in half. So not as bad as the agrimony of the Tixie tree foil, but still pretty annoying. So here's the flower of the next plant. It's kind of neat because it's in flower and seeding. And this is called hedge parsley is one of the common names. And you can see here, um, the seeds kind of resemble the flower head itself. And these two are little tiny sticky balls for their little hitchhiker seeds. Last but not least, maybe the most famous hitchhiker of them all. This is burdock. And you can see the seeds are pretty big. And uh, they grow in these long kind of shoot up seed pods here. And why these might be so famous is because there was a man named George de Maestral and he found me stuck to his dog after a hunting trip in 1940, and he came up with the idea for Velcro. So this is the plant. These are the seeds that gave that man the idea for Velcro. So there's your little fun fact for the day. Well, I want to thank you all for watching this week. Hopefully you learned something new and hopefully you have a better appreciation for some of these plants and the way they've adapted to transport your seeds and spread them all around. Well, we'll see you next week. Thanks for watching.